Another Aussie artist that works under a non diplume is Hannah Francis. Changed her name because somebody else in the United States that was in the music industry had the name Hannah Francis registered first. So to eradicate confusion, our Hannah Francis changed her name to Burning Grace and has been releasing product for the last couple of years under that moniker. Recently, we had the beautiful song called Let Me Go, which got a lot of attention from programs like the all-new Saturday Osmosis, Beats with Bria, and Breaking Barriers with Clint, as well as my program. Hannah, aka Burning Grace, has just released the album The Woman in the Mirror. It came out late last week, and here's a track from it. Under the Moon, one of the shorter tracks on the album. Oh, stars, oh, moon, oh. new Aussie music from Burning Grace from the album The Woman in the Mirror comes the track Under the Moon, which is not the focus track, just the track that I'd like when I had to listen to the album first up. On this album, you find the two previous singles, Electric and Let Me Go, which is the current focus single. Some of Australia's finest musos play across this album, including Brett Garsed, who was the guitarist for the John Farnham Band, as well as bass player Craig Newman, who was also in the John Farnham band, and a very good drummer called Jerry Pantasas, who's worked with a lot of people, including Guy Sebastian, Roachford in the UK, Tommy Emmanuel, Olivia Newton-John, and even our legendary band from the 60s, The Seekers. So some real class players. The producer is a guy called Lee Bradshaw, who is a very fine composer as well as producer. And he was in our studios last week having a chat to Peter Sullivan on the Piano Talk program about his own project, which is a classical music album, as well as some other things that Lee's got going on, as well as producing this album for Burning Grace called The Woman in the Mirror, which is now available across your DSPs and tracks from this album you will hear across our Oz Music programs here at 88.3. Quality with a capital Q. 